in a vlog today because I didn't think I was really doing anything that interesting this weekend um, and I've also been really tired at work this week so um, I thought I'd just like laze around and do nothing but then I decided no I haven't done any home cooking for a really long time the first thing I'm going to be making is some Oreo stuffed or Oreo however you say it um, stuffed chocolate chip cookies so a Oreo in the middle with chocolate chip cookie on the outside so they um, I'm gonna make quite a big batch of them because me and George me and George have got um, friends coming around tonight to watch Glastonbury on the TV. We're going to set it up in the garden, so hopefully they will munch on those. Um, and the second thing I'm making is um, sticky cauliflower. I'm going to make it with like rice. I <laughs> He's licking my face. Oh, you cutie. Um, yeah, it's like cauliflower with um, maple syrup um, on and soy sauce and sesame seeds, and it looks delicious. We have been out and got all of the ingredients and um, so we are now making Oreo stuffed chocolate chip cookies and they are vegan. Um, <laughs> so these are the ingredients that we all need for our cookies. First we will need baking powder, baking powder, ground the arrowroot, vanilla essence, some Oreos. Oreos. Now you could have picked Oreo the normal ones but I went for thins because I thought if they were too thick then that wouldn't be good. So um, this is um, dark chocolate chips. Yep. Um, I couldn't mm. find any vegan um, like milk chocolate or non-milk chocolate. So we got this too which sugar. is just sugar. The, bu the vegan butter so you don't need normal but you use vegan butter. And, some flour. Wait, and the flour, of course, or you can't make your cookie. <laughs> okay, so once you have finished with your flour, that's all ready to go for later. And now we have to make like the soft part up. So in a separate bowl, you're gonna add the vanilla essence, the, um, we have ground arrowroot, but you can use um, cornstarch, cornstarch instead. So they're like, they both do the same job, I think. Okay, and the water and sugar. you can spot it when I make this video up but I made a classic error on making these cookies. I used um, self-raising flour instead of normal flour. Oh my gosh look I'm crying because of the oven. Just put like air in my face. Um, it's so upsetting that we messed up the cookies. So this is the cookies. They do not look that bad however they are more of a cake. <laughs> so not happy so I quickly whipped up another batch about Darcy while she went on her swimming lesson and they are currently in the oven looking a lot better <laughs> made with normal flour <laughs> um, so yeah I will let you know how them ones go but I was just about I was getting so stressed out when I realized what I had done wrong because they were in the oven for like 20 minutes and looked awful I was like what on earth have I done hello so I was very stressed out about the cookie cakes. They ended up being cookie cakes, that's what I'm selling them as. They were cookie cakes, that was what they intended to be because they were very spongy. <laughs> but 
I was really stressed out. George ended up really, really liking them so much that he said that he wants to eat them all and we're not allowed to give them to everyone that comes around tonight. Um, so that's a success. I've calmed down now. I've got my glass of wine over there. Um, so now we are making dinner um, for me and George. I'm making cauliflower, uh, the sticky cauliflower dish. Um, yeah, so I will post, put a picture of the cookies now, the cookie cakes now and then show you how we're making the sticky cauliflower. So we just finished making it, uh, I'm going to try it now, it looks absolutely insane, it looks so tasty and I love sesame seeds at the moment so I'm really excited. So ready? Mm. <coughs> that is really tasty, really 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 good. Um, and it only took like 20 minutes to make so this will be a definite one we can make again. Mm. Mm. I am much better at cooking dinners than I am cookies <laughs> or any kind of bacon. What do you think? Really, really tasty. Mmm, mm. really good? Mm. Yummy. Really good. We can do this one again? This one again? Mm hmm. I think so. It's quite easy as well, it's quite quick. Yeah. watching my cooking vlog today um, I'm never ever probably gonna do a baking vlog ever again because it was quite unsuccessful however everyone really loved them like them cookies went down a tree and I cooked some more yesterday um, a whole nother batch of like 14 and me and George have been munching on them for the last few days and they are delicious so I probably will keep making them um, but only criticism definitely use the normal oreos not the thin ones like george definitely said like they need a bit more oreo in the middle like cream um so yeah we had a really nice time um it'd be great if like you 
let me know if you do attempt either of the recipes I've cooked in this vlog. Um, yeah, and like and subscribe as always, please. That would be amazing. See you later. Bye. <laughs>